hi everyone welcome to park Mess. in this video i'm going to solve this amazing math problem that is 2 raised to power x plus 4 raised to power x is equal to 8 raised to power x so first of all we will write this question in the solution again so the question is 2 raised to power x plus 4 raised to power x is equal to 8 raised to power x next 2 raised to power x plus we can write 4 as 2 raised to power 2 4 raised to power x is equal to we can also write 8 as 2 raised to power 3 whole raised to power x in next step we will use a famous exponential property that is a raised to power m whole raised to power n can also be written as a raised to power n or raised to power m by using this exponential property we can write this equation as 2 raised to power x plus here we will extend the powers here and here so it will become 2 raised to power x whole square is equal to 3 raised to power x 2 raised to power x whole power 3 now my dears as we are looking there that in these three terms the base 2 raised to power x is the same so we will let let 2 raised to power x is equal to y so we will replace 2 raised to power x in this equation with y so it will become implies y plus y square is equal to y cube next we will shape these two terms to the right hand side so this side will become 0 implies it will become y raised to power 3 minus y square minus y is equal to 0 next we will take y common from these three terms so it will become taking y common so it will become y square minus y minus 1 is equal to 0 there are two possibilities for this equation y will be equal to 0 or this expression will be equal to 0 so one possibility is y will be 0 the second possibility is y square minus y minus 1 will be equal to 0 now we will further solve this quadratic equation so this is a quadratic equation and we will solve it using the quadratic formula so first of all we will write the values of a b c and then we will use the quadratic formula so the value of a here is 1 and the value of b is minus 1 and the value of c is again minus 1 and the quadratic formula is minus b plus minus square root of b square minus 4 ac divided by 2 a so here we will replace the values of a b c so it will become y is equal to minus b the value of minus b is minus 1 minus 1 plus minus square root of minus b square so that is minus 1 square minus 4 ac the value of a is 1 and the value of c is minus 1 divided by 2a the value of a is 1 next minus minus is plus so it is plus 1 plus minus square root of minus 1 square is 1 and here 1 times minus 1 is minus 1 and minus 4 times minus 1 is plus 4 divided by 2 next it will become 1 plus minus square root of 5 divided by 2 so here there are two possible values of y 
वन ऑफ देम इज वन प्लस स्क्वे रूट ऑफ फाइव डिवाइडेड बाई टू इन द सेकेंड इज वन माइनस स्क्वे रूट ऑफ फाइव डिवाइडेड बाई टू बट एस वी प्रीवियसली कंसिडर डेट वाई इज इक्वल टू टू एक्स सो हेयर यू विल रिप्लेस वाई विथ टू रेस टू पावर एक्स नो एस फॉर एनी पॉजिटिव नंबर टू रेस टू पावर एक्स इज ऑलवेज पॉजिटिव सो वन माइनस स्क्वे रूट ऑफ फाइव डिवाइड बाई टू इज नॉट द पॉसिबल सोल्यूशन ऑफ टू रेस टू पावर एक्स एंड ऑल्सो वाई रेस टू पावर जीरो वाई इज इक्वल टू इज नॉट द पॉसिबल सोल्यूशन फॉर टू रेस टू पावर एक्स सो यू विल ओनली सॉल्व टू रेस टू पावर एक्स पावर वन प्लस स्क्वे रूट ऑफ फाइव डिवाइडेड बाई टू सो डेट इज टू रेस टू पावर एक्स इज इक्वल टू वन प्लस स्क्वे रूट ऑफ फाइव डिवाइड बाई टू नो वी विल टेक नेचर लॉक ऑन बोथ साइड्स टू फाइंड द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स सो इट विल बिकम नेचर लॉक ऑफ टू रेस टू पावर एक्स इज इक्वल टू नेचर लॉग ऑफ वन प्लस स्क्वे रूट ऑफ फाइव डिवाइड बाई टू सो हेयर दिस एक्स विल बी जम्प टू हेयर सो इट विल बिकम एक्स इन टू नेचर लॉग ऑफ टू इज इक्वल टू नेचर लॉग ऑफ वन प्लस स्क्वे रूट ऑफ फाइव डिवाइड बाई टू नेक्स्ट we divide both sides by natural log of 2 so it will become natural log of 2 into natural log of 2 so here on the left hand side this natural log of 2 will be cancelled with this one so only x will be left here and here we will use the log property that is log 1 plus square root of 5 divided by 2 base 2 so this is the required value of x that we need to find in this math problem